Dr. Paul Mason. Carnosine is critical for kidney health. And don't overdrink water. Concentrated urine is healthy. Measuring the amount of protein in the urine, now that's a good way of assessing kidney function. And I actually really like that because we do reliably see that it drops. And there's a number of lines of evidence that demonstrate that low carb diets where you cut the sugar out, you lower your blood sugar is actually beneficial. And if we take an example of a randomized trial, blinded study they done in diabetics, they give them a supplement called carnosine. Now mm -hmm. carnosine is basically two amino acids joined together. And it's what we call a glycation inhibitor because it attaches to the molecule of glucose and it stops that molecule of glucose then attaching to the cells of your body where it can damage them through glycation. Now, when we give diabetics this supplement, two amino acids, carnosine, we actually see that it actually reduces the protein in their urine and reduces the HbA1c, which is a blood marker of their average blood sugar levels. So we know that, you know, kidneys are one of these first things that get whacked on the head. And this is not medical advice, but the doses used in the research is 500 milligrams twice a day. And it's called carnosine, C-A-R-N-O-S-I-N-E. And I would point something out that the Latin root for the word flesh is carn. So this is actually deficient in vegetarian diets. It doesn't come from, from non-flesh foods. Vegetarians, more than anybody else, ought to be supplementing with this. And we seem to have this inability or this fear of letting people have concentrated urine. So as an athlete, we, we get them to pee on a urine dipstick and say, oh, it's not dilute enough, you must be dehydrated. And this whole fear of dehydration, which is just bunkum. And in actual fact, so what we actually did, we did a study at the Australian Institute of Sport well, what they found was that by telling people to drink more so their urine was diluted in the morning, they, they had to drink so much that they'll wake up in the middle of the night to pee and the sleep disturbance was impacting their performance more than anything else. And what I actually tell people is, as you know, from medical school physiology, one of the first findings that the kidney is starting to lose its function, in addition to the, the traces of protein, is the loss of concentrating capacity. Basically means that your urine, normally you should sleep through the whole night, your kidneys are doing their job, and it will have very concentrated urine of a small volume that you don't need to empty out overnight. If your kidneys start to fail, you, they can't effectively concentrate, so you have to end up with much larger volumes, which inevitable, inevitably will wake you up. So oh. this whole notion that you have to drink and keep your keep your urine clear and if your urine's not clear you've got a problem no the body we you know the body's smarter than that as um as i was told when i was a resident trying to calculate precise amounts of magnesium and potassium in intravenous fluids you know the, the dumbest kidney is smarter than the smartest intern measuring the amount of protein in the urine is a good way to assess kidney function there are multiple lines of evidence that on a low carb diet, cutting out sugar, is beneficial to the kidneys. In a study, randomized, blinded trial with diabetics, they were given a supplement, carnosine. Carnosine is two joined together amino acids. It is a glycation inhibitor, which prevents glucose molecules from attaching to body cells, which are damaged by glycation. When diabetics were given carnosine supplement, the results were it reduced protein in the urine. It reduced the HbA1c levels. This is a test to show the average blood sugar level. The dose used was 500 milligrams of carnosine twice a day. Carnosine is deficient in vegetarian diets. It does not come from non-flesh foods. Vegetarians should supplement with carnosine. Concentrated urine, is this a mythical fear? For example, athletes urine check, too concentrated, they must be dehydrated. In a study by the Australian Institute of Sport, athletes were told to drink more water in the morning. They ended up drinking so much that 
they woke up at night to pee. The result? Their sleep disruption was actually the main problem to their performance. The first finding that the kidneys are losing function, besides traces of protein in the urine, is the loss of concentrating capacity. Normally, kidneys doing their job, concentrated low levels of urine, able to sleep through the whole night. When kidneys start to fail, they can't concentrate urine. So there's a larger volume of urine wakes us up. The notion that you must drink more, keeping urine clear, no. The body is smarter than that. Dr. Mason says, when I was a resident in hospital, calculating exact amounts of magnesium and potassium in intravenous fluids, I was told, the dumbest kidney is smarter than the smartest intern. Annotated, summarized. Please share with a loved one.